Hi guys, I'm in Vienna, Austria, and this is a city that glistens under normal circumstances, and being here at Christmas time just takes it to a whole other level. And tonight, I wanted to go out and just walk around some of the different Christmas markets in Vienna, so I'm here at Spittelberg, and we'll see what we find. This market, Spittelberg, I'm here because I asked my Austrian friends who live in Vienna where I should go because there are a ton of markets in the city and they all unanimously said that I had to come to this market because it's a little more local, there aren't as many tourists and there's these cute little streets and the market is just all throughout the little streets so you have to kind of wander around. It's really cute and I've also noticed that although there is lots of food, there are tons of booths of handicrafts and it's really, really nice stuff. So I think this is the best place I've seen for actual shopping so far. We found this lovely booth that has maps from all over the world and I found a postcard of Berlin. So I'm gonna get it for my friends because I think it's better than a normal Christmas card. They have tons of cities and they're all illustrated with things that remind you of that city. So it's really cool, I think they'll like it. just walking through this market and I saw Santa Claus so obviously I wish him a Merry Christmas and he came over he's like do you want to get a photo <laughs> and then I told him I'd been really good this year and he's like really and then I have something for you and I said really you do and so he reached into his bag and he's like don't worry it's healthy and he gave me a clementine and then a handful of peanuts how nice is that I think he's just this man who's wandering around I mean obviously it's Santa but also it could be just a man who's really kind wandering around giving people treats, so I promised I would share it with Mark. <laughs> central main enormous Christmas market in Vienna at the Rat House which is the city hall right behind me and where Schmittelbeck was incredibly quaint and cute this one is so cool it's enormous we've just come and I can't believe how many lights there are there's people everywhere there's huge rows of food and people selling things and I see people skating over there and I just I suddenly feel like a child because like look at this look at this are you kidding Christmas market dreams are made out. I was very, very attracted to this booth because it looks like a Christmas explosion in here. Some of the things here seem like they're inspired by Austria too because there's a little skier and then this is one of my favorites. Look at the sky. <laughs> His little heart that says Wien or Vienna. <laughs> it's just absolutely adorable. Jesus, danke. I think they're brother and sister. Actually looks like me and my brother kind of. I need a third one for my sister and then we have the full set. <laughs> I can't stop smiling. I've just got some food because I'm starving and it's a sausage inside this enormous half baguette. I've never had this before. I'm just gonna go for it. Oh, hot! Oh, oh. oh my god, there's cheese in the sausage. Did not expect that. Probably should have run this time. You cannot come to a Christmas market and not get a hot mug of something. So I went for classic Glühwein or mulled red wine and I have been coveting these cups that people are carrying around. They have these little red boots and then this angel mug or Engelkasse and I really had to have one. So if you put a deposit in, you can either keep the mug or you can bring the deposit back and get your four euros back, which is what it costs. So it says Chris Kindlemarkt and on this side it says Rathaus Platz and I just love it. It's so cozy and it's keeping my hands very nice and warm. And soon my insides are gonna be warm too. Oh, you cannot beat that. You just can't, you can't. I found 
one for you to give me. It says kiss me. <laughs> couldn't help getting one last treat at the Christmas market. <laughs> I found this, it's called a Tim Stan or a Cinnamon Star and it looks absolutely delicious. And I can't lie you guys, I was planning to go to more Christmas markets tonight and kind of look at more of them, but I had no idea that the one here at the Rat House was going to be this incredible. It's like Christmas swished into hyperdrive or something. There are just lights on every surface and the Ferris wheel and skating and the food and the up lighting on the rat house like it's all just absolutely incredible and I found that I just didn't want to leave <laughs> so I hope that you enjoyed seeing two Christmas markets in Vienna first at Spittelbeck which was really cute in those little tiny streets and then this one which is just absolutely incredible I've loved visiting here so much <laughs> so I hope that you guys enjoyed it too please leave a comment down below tell me what you thought of this insane Christmas market and if you haven't already subscribe to the channel if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video. I'm gonna eat this now. Bye. <laughs>